Hi everyone, for this video we're going to look at how to solve for a particular variable. So we're given this equation here, a equals one half h, parentheses a plus b, and we're solving for b. So there's a few different ways you can do this. I'm just going to go with the way that I saw first, um, and the way that I see first is that I want to get rid of this one half. So to get rid of the fraction one half, I'm going to multiply by the reciprocal. So I'm going to multiply by two over one on both sides. And by doing that, it gets rid of that de denominator two. And so I'm left with two a is equal to h a plus b. Because remember, our goal is to get this b by itself. And that b is inside parentheses, so I want to get stuff get rid of stuff that are surrounding it first. So the next thing I notice is um, I still have this h here that I want to get rid of. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide by h on both sides. And if I do that, I'm left with 2a over h on this side. And notice the h's cancel. And then I have the a plus b. And then remember, again, we're trying to get this b by itself, but if I want to get that b by itself, i got to get rid of that a, and so I'm going to do the opposite, which is subtract a on both sides. And again, if I do that, notice those a's cancel, and I'm left with 2a over h minus a on the left-hand side, and that is equal to b. So that is um, one way to do it. That's not necessarily the only way to do it, but that's just what I saw first. So let's take a look at how you would do it a different way. So most likely you probably notice that you want to distribute all this stuff first, and there's no wrong reason for that. You can do that. Um, so if I do that, I have the one half, right? And well, actually, let's start with this. This may be a little bit better. Let me write it out first. So if I want to get rid of this 1 half, I'm still going to multiply by 2 over 1 on both sides. It cancels out. So I have 2a is equal to h, a plus b. And then here you're probably like, well, I'm going to distribute. So you can do that. And if I do that, I have 2a is equal to h, a plus h, b. And again, we want to get this b by itself, but I can't get rid of that h that's right next to that b yet until I get rid of this h, a. So I'm going to subtract h, a on both sides. And when I do that, I have 2a minus h, a, and that's going to give me h, b on this side. And then I want to get this b by itself still, and so I'm going to divide by h on both sides. So the h's are gone, and I'm left with 2a minus h a all over h, and that equals b. So you probably notice that these answers look very different, but they're actually the same as what we got before, because if you were to actually split this up, and you get 2a over h minus h a over h on this left hand side here, you will see that these h's cancel. All right, so this all still equals b, but if I were to simplify this some more, that would give me the 2a over h minus a. So these are equivalent answers, so if you got this, or if you got this, they both are the same. 